Oh no! It's gonna take a few minutes for these people to uh, figure out that we're live. Here? Yeah. Counterclockwise, start signing. Start yes. buying time. <laughs> I figured we'd lay them all out, sign them all, do it again, do it again, do it again. So. Wait until about uh, 20 or 30 people have logged on. Can you hear us? Yeah, okay. hey, we're live now. So. Oh. oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> you big dummy, you big dummy. I think you should be the star of the I'm crazy. Yeah. So outside, we got a ball jump, and we got an omelet bar, and... Show them the back. Popeye nearest me. <laughs> Open it up. Make sure you have a good sharp good, because we got a lot of bunch. Yeah. I don't know, man. Van Owen Street or Colorado in by our uh, by uh, Eagle Rock. I think. I'll I don't know. Wait, where is? You show me too. This is what you call a download card. Let me see. So you don't yeah, it's have upside to, down. Yeah, don't let them see the number, man. <laughs> oh, yeah, man. They're going to download it for free. Yeah. yeah. All right, so there's a download yeah, a card. download card. It looks like that with stuff on it. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on, ladies hold and on people. Hold on, ladies and gentlemen. This is what you call beer. I don't know if you can see that. You can see it. It looks good. That's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's a Pilsner. It looks like the view from the bottom of the uh, mug when, the, when it's getting forward from the, the tap. Pat, have you signed any of these yet? No. That looks like what you buy at Spencer Pip, like a, like a dog ball on the floor. <laughs> Where are all the Sharpies? Sharpie? I'm signed up You're for this up. batch. <laughs> there you go, Jimmy. <laughs> so these are for all y'all that pre ordered the album and got it signed. This is going out next week. We'll be answering a few questions afterwards in about like, I don't know, five or 10 minutes. As soon as we get about uh, 20 or 30 more people. So that could be yours. This could be yours. These are not numbered. And they're not personalized. See, that could be yours. I don't think I'm not saying so. Yeah, David, he's up here too. Oh. You guys have that palette? Oh. Well, I'm, I'm sorry, here. Billy's really doing a NASCAR in Pomona, huh? I'm gonna go. Ready? Yeah. Tomorrow, tomorrow, tomorrow! Sunday! Yeah. <laughs>
Someday, literally. <laughs> Where's the hidden joke in there? Be careful about cards, everybody. No, I haven't, so that's the only one I... Yeah. Did yeah. you do this middle section, David? Or no? Uh, yeah. I did most, did yeah. That that's, it, that's the last one. Okay. Yeah. What else? Is somebody playing the other night? You guys tried to go see? Uh, oh, that was um, the Christians. Christian? The Christian band, uh, Swiper. Right. Oh. That was oh, wait. Yeah, I, guess it was a I don't know. Ask King how long. <laughs> Do we want to take this outside and just sit down and answer some questions? All right. Questions? Do you want to just answer it out loud? Can I do that? Mm -hmm. Yeah, because we're live with the mic. Oh, hey, everybody. Let's see. Pat, you take over. You're smoking. <laughs> uh -huh. ah, just stare at the dog. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everybody, do you have any questions while well, you got us? Hey, Mike Rios, who does our hair? <laughs> oh, never mind. Try to do it in reverse. First down. <laughs> Tim, who is your favorite band now and why? Kirk, you've asked enough questions. You have to wait. <laughs>
Will from Cooters and Eagles Pass. Hey, what's up? Yeah, the 21st should be good for anybody that is in or around Eagles Pass, Texas. Uh, William Shannon is putting a uh, free show on uh, December 21st. We're going to be at uh, Cooters. And then other people. Uh, free show? Uh, yeah, free. Can we put a tip jar on or something? Yeah, we put a tip jar. <laughs> Um, so that's going to be a cool show. We're also playing uh, Fort Worth uh, and then also playing Austin City Limits on the 20th. So, come on down. Who's buying the first round? Jerry Tucker. Well, I think you answered that question. You are. Uh, Death Kiss Morning. Please re record it. Uh, we're not going to comment on that. <laughs> uh, we sold it to Rap. Me and Joey wrote that song. Joey for Verbal Abuse. Rest in peace. Yeah, Joey was cool. Um, turned my 21 year old niece onto you guys. Absolutely love slipping away. Very cool. Thank you, Jeff Knoll. Along with skating, do I mountain bike? No, no, that's too dangerous. I uh, face climb, or what do you call it? FaceTime? <laughs> no, that thing where you uh, go up the side of mountains, like wall bare, climbing, but bare, bare fist, bare handed, and, uh, and uh, shoeless. Oh, like on Naked and Afraid, where all those people have to go in the Amazon and kind survive like for 21 days? Yeah. Kind of like that, but totally different. That's, that's my usual life. <laughs> I face climb to get away face from climb. that. Face <laughs> climb. Uh, what's that? When are you coming back to the Winchester? Uh, probably next year. We'll see. We're working on some uh, stuff. Winchester, where is that? At, uh, Cleveland. Oh, yeah. Uh, we're working on some stuff for next year. Obviously, I mean, if you guys haven't heard, we're... Um, after we do the Texas run in February, we're opening up for uh, Danko Jones uh, for four shows at San Diego, Los Angeles, um, San Francisco, and uh, Paris, Huntington Beach, London, and Paris, London. No, I think pop music. Singapore. Uh, we're, it's really stoked because uh, Danko asked us to uh, do it, and uh, you know, obviously we, we jumped at the chance. I mean, you know. A huge influence on us. How high did you jump, Pat? We jumped high. I jumped as high as like your your face timing. You got like six inch vertical. Yeah. When are you coming back to the UK? I don't know. Jimmy will answer that question. Soon come, man. Ah, there you go. Um, yeah. Ow, 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 ow. Um, David, were the lyrics of Simple Man inspired by, by the Leonard Skinner? No. I mean, he is over there, but I can answer for him. No. With certainty. See you kids at Danko Jones. Yep. Yep. Which one? Hi, guys. Poland here. Oh. Uh, you're representing the whole country? What Thank countries you. are you potentially to be visited in 2020? Um, Spain. Yeah, Spain. Uh, Italy. Probably Italy. Italy. Probably maybe, maybe Austria. The, maybe the uh, UK. Maybe the UK, yeah. Um, Hopefully. Hopefully Spain. I mean, we're shooting for Spain in uh, December uh, or possibly earlier. We don't know yet. We'll let you know that as soon as we know. What's everybody for, doing for Turkey Day? What are you doing, Jimmy? Partying. You going to smoke a turkey? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah we're going to have them yams and turkeys. And <coughs> smoke yams. Macaroni yeah. and cheese. Yeah. CBD on it. CBD turkey. <laughs> Uh, will you guys be coming back to New England in the new year? I, uh, uh, yes. Uh, yes. Yes. Sometime in 2020. Yeah. Uh, you're working on any new material for a new album? Yes. 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 Um, I want to say thanks for the music all these years. I want to say thank you. I would love to. Any plans to come back to Seattle? Yeah. Yes. Seattle and Portland. I'm, we're, it's looking like August for that. Mm -hmm. That's the discussion. Can anyone hear me? Yeah. Uh, yeah, we're uh, we're working on a plan for um, yeah. August. Oh, there I am. Now we lost. Let's get to uh, That's a better shot. Um, I'm here. You just can't see. Yeah, me. you can sit right there. It's fucking close. Isn't it? <laughs> it's, okay. it's closer. <laughs> I know. Huh? Uh, yeah, we're working on a uh, kind of a run in august uh it's uh possible it's looking like um we're going to take an opener with us that is uh the band speed buggy and um no i won't be playing with speed buggy in two sets <laughs> stop smoking yeah i know 
Thanks, Mom. But, but I do it good. <laughs> Thanks, Mom. Thanks, Mom. I hate you. Jimmy Gooen says Todd. Hey, Todd. <laughs> What's up, McGowan? What's up? William Shannon, you need to send Ace Swan Johnson an invite. Him and Ricky Rackman talked about wanting to go to the show. What's oh, that? they'll be there. I was I was having drinks with Ace last night. What's he's going. going. Danko, I have to say. Oh. Yeah. Oh, I think he's talking about Cooters and Eagles Pass. Oh, yeah. I'm mm, more than welcome. Yeah, yeah. I don't think they need an invite. No. Okay. Brilliant. This December, you mean, or next year? No, next year. Not yes. uh, 20. No, We're talking 20. 19, the only thing, we're finishing off the year with the Texas runs, the three shows in Texas, and that's going to wrap us up for 19. So new record next week, and then three shows, and then we start up, the first announced stuff is the stuff of Danko in February on the West Coast. Yeah. So we're getting to some people that, we haven't been to San Diego in, I don't know how long, so we're doing that. Long time. And the Viper, of course, and all the, you saw, yeah, everyone knows the dates, Huntington Beach, things like that. Yeah. And then more will be announced soon, I hope. Uh, how about a show with shit list? Okay. Okay. Done. That's on our shit list. That's it. <laughs> Good with you. Hey. Any plan? Any chance of playing M three? Um, no. Not looking likely. Uh, Jimmy McGuinn, what speed buggy? Yeah, speed buggy. August. Uh, we're working on that. August run. And also, everyone seemed to like the acoustic thing so much, we're thinking about expanding it and doing a, some acoustic-only shows. Yeah. An evening with Junkyard. Storytellers type thing. Or unplugged, whatever. Unplugged. Uh, no, op no open Q&A. <laughs> no uh, we're going to have a Q&A, but that's going to be between us on stage. <laughs> it's just, a, so we can it's like, a G the chord. Is it a G? <laughs> <laughs> Any Pittsburgh dates in 2020? Uh, maybe. Maybe. Well, where's the, the the thing? The private is there, so maybe Pittsburgh. Yeah. All right, Pat, you go sign. All right. Who can moderate this? You're a good moderator. Yeah. Jimmy, Just you scroll down on that side. You're a good modulator. Well, I can't see any of that shit from here. See, you're <laughs> here. I want to do that because I can't. What do we got? Hey. I do like the guitar picks, Billy Boyd. Thank you. Hi, Billy. Yes. Um, I heard that thing. I don't know what, you know. I'm not worried about fans not liking us opening for Danko. I think we'll be just fine. I don't worry about stuff like that. Um, I love Charlie Vaughn, of course. It was great fun. It's great. Good guys, and Charlie's the best. Those are fun dates. Nebraska, maybe. Great, maybe. great Springsteen record. <laughs> Fantastic. One of his best. Uh, you should question this year almost. Yeah, December next year we're talking. Everything's 20 that we're talking about. Um, oh, yeah. Yeah, Steve Boyles. Hey. Um, hey, Doc Hopper. Hey, Doc. Hopper. <laughs> People <laughs> of Earth. Baba Booey to you all. Um, <laughs> Baba Booey. How do I scroll down? Someone help me. All right. New comments. Here we go. Hi, from Michigan. Hello from uh, the Valley. Hey, Tim, uh, what's up with the Redskins? Let's, let's keep this civil. Um, <laughs> you guys should do Junker Jerry Freedom Festival. Yeah, okay, Jerry. You, you pay us, we show. Um, see you, oh, see you, Mike, in a, uh, about a month, I guess. Yeah, um, see you soon. Like those new barks? Yeah, I did. We, Jimmy and I went down there and played in the, in the uh, Black Star um, what is showroom. showroom. Thank yeah. you. We, they were really cool. I recommend them highly. Um, let's see. Acoustic show. Yeah, they're the everyone seemed to like the Viper and I think we can we're gonna expand it and take it out and do a full set of just acoustic. So bring a keyboard player. Bring a keyboard player a little bit of that. That's the idea. We'll see if we're gonna throw up the flagpole and if people salute we'll do it. How's that? Yeah. You guys need a skin exam. Yeah, probably. Um, some sort of exam? Yes, I do. Doc's a oh, doc. Doc's a oh, uh, no. dermo. Uh -huh. um, yeah, Brook Park. We, I've never played there actually. I'm excited for that. Coming to camp, we'd love to. If the authorities would allow us, we'd love to be up there. It's, I've, I've been told that we should be able to, but then our would things happen. Any plans to hook up with Bradley for another East Coast show? I think that'd be fun. Ask Brad. He knows how to find us, but we'd love to do it. I love Brad. 
Come to Norway. I'd love to go to Norway. Yes. My wife and seven-year-old son sitting next to me want to know if you were playing. I thought, you know, we never get to play all ages shows. And trust me, we have kids that can't come see us play either. So it's always kind of a bummer that we can't do them. Um, Sometimes we can slip them into this. <laughs> I've slipped my, my son into a sound check. That's about yeah. as far as we've gotten. Yeah. But we don't have any plans for an all ages. And um, I guess that the whiskey's all ages, but we haven't played there in a while. We've been kind of at the Viper, which is not all ages. What do we got? Um, so Jim first down, kind of all night. You think, well, that sounds familiar. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Thank you, Kirk. We, we appreciate that. Uh, you need to come in the back. We just, we, yeah, we were in Maine not too long ago, I thought. Tennessee shows in 2020. Um, well, this summer thing we're talking about uh, for August of next year, that might head that way, but I'm not sure towards Tennessee. It might be a more Western activity. Um, no all ages, yeah. Roach, I, I still need the address. Okay, I don't know what that means. Um, Kirk Erickson? Um, I'll message you later. He'll message you later. El pa wow. Well, welcome back, El Paso from the 80s. Montreal, yeah, hopefully. We'd like to get to Canada. Ah, I met you back at Milton Keynes, early 90s. Huh? Got to sing the day, best night of my life. Paul Nash. Well, all right. He was right here. All right, David's jumping to the front. Come on, David. <clears throat> Who's upgrading the thing? You. No. I'm moderating. Thank you, El Paso, Las Vegas. We'd love to see you back soon. I don't know about the junkyard speed buggy thing. It's sounding like it's a, a Western thing, Jim. Is that the summer? Yeah. I know there's places we need to go, like uh, St. Louis, Kansas City area. Uh, some people in Kentucky have been asking. That Midwest, sort of, I guess that's considered Midwest. Jimmy. What was your first guitar? Uh, um, well, I guess it was a Rickenbacker 375. Or was it 76? Dave? Yeah. Where is it? Tell, tell the story about the lead singer of the Bullet Boys again. <laughs> <laughs> what story? There's yeah. many stories. I have many stories. But They're you know who has more good. stories is uh, Mr. Beasley. But he's at liberty to share those he likes. I'm not going to use this uh, format, this platform to go off on uh, Mark. I've never met him on a one-on-one -on -one individual basis, but uh, uh, you get me alone and in a corner while well, I can give you some stories. Yeah. Sort of like the Mr. Trump of rock and roll. How many songs written for the new album that will definitely make it on the album? We have no clue at this point. Too early in the process, Jason. The next album? Yeah. Probably four. I would say that. Hey, Kirk, what's up, man? Jerry, David Roach, what's up, brother? What's up, man? You left me some weird message the other day. I got you back to you. Jerry, your lover? No. Okay. Uh, now, is that Jerry or Eric? It was Jerry. No. Uh, I'm sorry, Jerry. Are you guys Eric, down you know. for a Grand Slam Metal Jam in 2020? Junk Eric, Pussy Cat, L.A. Guns, and Tom Kiefer. Why not? Yeah, Let's it. do it, man. What is it? A Rudy, Tootie, Fresh and Fruity? Yeah, is that something you can get at Denny's? Stay gold. Thanks, Todd. Uh, love some of Dave's old Baracha stuff remastered and released. I bet you Dave would like that, too. Yeah, Joe Almeida or Bam Ross maybe have uh, the... I don't know who has the masters. Caleb Moore, interesting question. Compared to the 80s, has the music industry got easier or more difficult, and why? I don't know. This may answer. Not, we don't, I don't pay attention to We don't to deal that with shit. the music industry. Yeah. Uh, really. Sorry, that's as good as we can go. Charlie, get within 250 miles of Cincinnati. My crew and I will travel, just like last year. Right on, Charlie. You did travel, didn't you? 
Charlie, is that Charlie? Uh, Charlie Hobbs. Charles. Hey, Charlie. Elvis, I've been wondering what record level uh, request you didn't follow back in the day. I mean, what they wanted you to do artistically, musically, that you didn't like necessarily and told them to fuck off. I don't know, that was a long time ago. Well, they, we didn't what tell it, them to fuck off. We, yeah. we, wrote, we did as many songs as we did. I mean, we, they wanted to hear a single and they didn't. Um, but yeah, you know, I mean, we didn't tell them to fuck it. off. No, no. no. I don't think there was any. They knew us well enough that they weren't going to ask us anything too stupid. Uh, It's a whole band back living in California. Uh, Some of you still call Texas home. Nope, we're all out here. Texas is always. We played the same bass. Notice many battle scars. Last show I was at. Uh, I don't know, two years, three years. Chris, hey, Cheese, what's happening, brother? Cheese, bro. Hey, Roach, what size shirt do you wear? Large. My local tattoo shop wants to give you one. So large. Oh, yeah. I'll represent. Okay, we've tapped out the question. Oh, no, we still got them going. Hey, thanks, new vices. That it? All right now, we'll be back in a second. <laughs> Why are you calling Tori? Just abandoned the line. All right, you guys go pick it up. Oh, we ran out there. Oh, Jesus. Dummy. <laughs> Why don't you All right, everybody. Thanks for coming. Uh, we're in the middle of signing um, a couple hundred uh, of these things. Um, go buy it. Go buy it. Um, pre-order. Is there any last questions before we uh, before we um, sign off? Roach, what size shirt do you wear? My local tattoo shop wants to give you one. Okay. Large. Why sad? <laughs> do bands need record company still? We sort of do. Yeah. Uh, we don't. Being in a band is enough for us. Being a record company on top of it is not, not my idea of fun. So um, yeah, I mean we're with a record label that is pretty pretty amazing. Um, Acetate's need- got Super Suckers, Hangman, and a slew of other Rod Bucket, you know, rest in peace. But um, yeah, you need a record label. Um, Suffice to say, we couldn't do it without. Them, nah. So uh, when are you guys going to put a record and live show? Uh, we already did that. We did a live record. This is the the last kind of retrospective. The old habits is kind of we're putting a kind of a bow on the old stuff, and from now everything now will be brand new. I think we're talking about doing a new single that will be done probably come out in spring, and but that's just in the talking stages. But this is this is the the if all you junkyard completists, this is the completion. This is the last. This this stuff will be released. From then from now on, it'll be just new stuff. This new release. Out. I mean, a lot of people have. Uh, you know, said I already have it with Triple X and Joker and whatnot. And actually, you you know, to tell you the truth, you haven't because that was a really, um, it was a non-mastered version, uh, and it had no artwork attached to it. And uh, this time around, um, the artwork has you know distinct liner notes to explain what really happened in 1992. We remastered everything. We spent a lot of time on remastering it. So oh, it sounds amazing. Yeah, it's huge. It's really good. So, uh, yeah. Anyone who had like the random YouTube downloads or whatever they've done, they've ripped. This is this is really what it is. And I'm sure those burn CDs you have have all burned out by now, anyway. So. Yeah, <laughs> using them for uh, yeah, who knows? They're coasters. Yeah. Um, are you signing the CDs? Yeah, I I don't think so. It's just vinyl. Just only. vinyl signing. Yeah. Any more back patches? Uh, probably the first of the year. We kind of uh, ran out of them, and uh, we're going to make them again. We also have some new designs that are going to be coming. Uh, uh, during the Danko shows, uh, we're going to be offering up some new designs and kind of retiring some old ones. Uh, are you still original members? Yes. Uh, uh, three, three out of three. I mean, we're. I mean, three yeah, out of five. Uh, five out of five. I mean, come on. It's been thirty years. <laughs> Thinking of remastering. Yes, it was remastered. It is. It's remastered. Very well. Uh, Acetate does a great job. Yeah, Acetate is a fantastic label. Um, they really. Uh, it's it's a label that's ran by a musician. He understands yeah. the situation. Yeah. 
Any new videos coming soon? Actually, that's a good, uh, good question. Hey, who said that? Hey, uh, who is that? That's Doc Harper. Yes. Yes. Uh, yeah, we're uh, we did a video. Um, we're pushing too far. <laughs> uh, that's gonna that's gonna have um, some uh, old footage, and uh, we shot some new footage. And uh, archival, archival, yeah. It's, and then some new uh, footage of us. Yeah, our pretty face. Looking a little better with you right now. <laughs> yeah, I hope to see you guys at M3. Sorry. Um, not looking good at all. We're, I, I mean, basically, we're not doing M3. Um, sorry. If something changes, we'll let you know. Yeah, and but now we're not. No. Not to say that you shouldn't go, but we're not bagging sure, on anything. Do. You know, sure, they do. they do their thing and we do ours. Exactly. Uh, where's Jimmy? Is he smoking? <laughs> He's on fire! You nailed it. Uh, Jimmy James joined. Hey, do you want to ask a question? I did. <laughs> you did? Oh, there's Jimmy. I got a like on it. <laughs> you guys should play Louder Than Life in Louisville, Kentucky. Oh, we don't know that song. It's a venue. Oh, <laughs> well, We can learn it. With Baker. No. With Baker. He's busy. He's, very, He's, got, very a, busy. he's got a day job. And we get a bunch of more people uh, coming in. All right, we're going to sign off here in about in about three minutes. So if anybody's got any questions, um, maybe explain to people how you know they want to come to your city. It just be, you know, well, they, yeah, we, we just did. Uh, <laughs> we just did. They heard you. We want to come with to your city. Trust us. But logistics are complicated when the the Rapping five of out. us are getting us there. Yeah. And, and not coming back with it's not as cobwebs yeah. in our wallet. We hear, I mean, we we read, we read yes, all Jimmy. The, yeah, uh, we read all your comments about coming to a city, uh, and you know, we want to go, but sometimes uh, it's not as easy as just saying, "Yeah, we're going to go." Uh, there's a lot of business involved, and um, you know. But we are trying. We are trying. Do you guys like? <laughs> <laughs> yes, we do. <laughs> we'll wait in line. It's got stuff in it. <laughs> Uh, have you ever toured with the Hangman? No, no, no. no that no. would Jimmy. That would. That would be Jimmy. That would get kill very me. Tired. Yeah. Who's your but favorite Brody? Oh, come on, Cheese. We know it's you. Hey, it's Cheese. Hammond and Rollins drove down the hill. All right. Yeah. All right. We're gonna sign off. David's gonna say hello and goodbye. Goodbye. Hello. See you at the show. And uh, thanks for everyone for dropping by. Yeah, yeah. Appreciate it. Get the new record, Old Habits I Hard, available the 22nd. Pre-order, please. See on the road, 2020. Yes. Bye from the Valley. See you guys later.